hello friends so we are now transitioning from winter to spring and ayurveda says that winter when winter it is very cold and it's dry it's a vata season spring is a kapha season the reason spring is a kapha season is because especially where i live in northern us it's cold it rains a lot we have a saying april flower brings may april showers bring may flowers so it rains a lot it's humid it's cold and we see very little sun in spring because every other day it's raining and that is typical kapha season and that builds up kapha in everyone so be very mindful during spring so that you don't get allergies you don't get flu because it's a flu season here as well what would you do do not at first and foremost consume hot liquids throughout the day the day when it is very hot because temperatures will be fluctuating from like 30 degrees centigrade or 80 deg 80 degrees fahrenheit to somewhere around 60 so when it is hot yeah it's okay to drink room temperature water or ice cold liquids if you are pitta type specially but it's not okay for everyone else and if when it is cold drink hot liquids warm teas green teas herbal teas ginger tea those are your friends especially when it's raining and it's cold tip number 2 is to eat add spices in your diet like ginger cinnamon clove cardamom these are some warm spices they are going to warm up your body spe specifically if you are a kapha or a vata kind of person you have to be very careful during this season and tip number 3 is to have a very healthy uh, diet which is very easy to digest and do not eat leftovers but eat freshly cooked meals easy to digest like khichdi porridge warm oats things like that and reduce sugar it's it say, it goes without saying no sugar no processed food no artificial colors no artificial preservatives just go natural with that if you are into health and wellness like this video follow me on social media and forward it to your friends who you feel can benefit from this knowledge with that i'll see you soon